This episode is powered by Poddex. Let's go! Turn up the volume. The volume. And now, from Brooklyn, New York, this is The Basement Surge with John and Frank. Three, two, two, one. Hey everybody, uh, it's John here from The Basement Surge. Uh, I'm joined by Frank, of course. Say hi, Frank. <laughs> hi, Frank. Uh, tonight starts our Seven Days to Die series. And Frank is already engulfed in play. He is waiting for me to come on and uh, join him on the server that he and I started. But uh, first, I want to talk a little bit about Poddex right off the bat. Uh, head on over to poddex.com, get yourself your own deck of cards with episode ideas, with questions for you to ask uh, on an interview. These decks of cards are awesome. Uh, every podcaster needs to get them. Head on over to poddex.com and use the code BASEMENT10 uh, at checkout and get 10% off. All right, guys, I'm going to head into the game. Uh, I'll see you there. They did such a good job upgrading this game, John. They really did. Yeah, they really It did. looks beautiful now. So we're playing Seven Days to Die. Um, the way we're going to work the this series is that we're going to do 40-minute uh, episodes until we get to uh, Horde Night. So The seventh day. The seventh day. That should be a lot of fun. <laughs> Once you survive the the seventh day, it's, you know, you, you're doing good. Yeah. yeah. Head on over to our website thebasementsurge.com for uh, everything we're putting out episodes videos pod, our podcast releases every Monday and Friday go subscribe new game I love it start the basics there we go alright so Frank we need to be best friends buddies pals how do we uh, did you oh wait did you you just invite me to a group i did you want to be my friend i want to be your friend i want to know where you are at all times <laughs> he wants to know where i am honey he's tracking me down all right here yeah. allies yes yes party member yes do i want to know where, where you are where, 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 where they start you off john where are you i have no, I idea. no idea that's a you are north of me. Yep. You are I see. South. Uh, are you in the green area? Two clicks. Am I in the green area? Yes, I am. Yeah, the forest area. All right, that's the good area. You stay there. I'll come to you. All right, I'm right by a, a uh, really good house, so it looks nice. All the starter houses are good. Well, not all of them. <laughs> well, they're good because you have a certain amount of distance before... The zombie starts showing up. Craft a bedroll. Which my first zombie just showed up. He shouldn't have been in here. <laughs> Bitch! Come on. Mess with daddy. Come on. I'll take you hand to hand. Uh. Alright, so I'm assuming we're going to stay in this house here. Uh, we want to try and... I fell through the floor. <laughs> oh, shit! Frank! <laughs> um, I got a problem. <laughs> what? <laughs> I fell through the floor and there's a zombie in the basement, but I'm kind of glitched between. I'm not glitched, but I'm stuck between floors. If I go down, if I go down, the zombie's gonna get me, but I can't get back up. I don't know what to do. <laughs> oh man, you're in a bad spot. Huh? I really am. Like this old decrepit house, I fell through the floor. Zombie's gonna kill me right off the bat. We just started. It's all right. It, it, it builds character. Maybe if I break this block and try to jump up. It's gonna take you forever to break uh, to break that block I'm, by hand. I'm a little more than halfway through. There's a zombie right above me. All He'll right. help you break it. <laughs> okay, you push me down. Oh my god. 
Back door? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, I thought there weren't supposed to be zombies in the starter areas. They're not supposed to. And what the hell are they doing here? I guess they changed it up. You know, you this game is constantly updating. You messed up on the settings when you set this up. I did not. <laughs> you, think, you think I would purposely make it more difficult for you? Yes, you did. Oh. Well, I mean, you are. I mean, I'm not going to say you're wrong, <laughs> but I'm not going to say you're right. You know what's a good thing about starting off in the, in the forest area? I mean, in the grassy area, though. Oh. I mean, the desert. You hear me? Yeah, I hear, hear me? You. The forest area... The, the, the forest area is the best area to be in because it has like the most trees and plants and stuff, you know, and the weather is perfect. You know, you don't overheat, you don't get cold. But the good part about the desert is that's where all the aloe vera plants are for the, for the first, to make the first aid items. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's bullshit. He is so far away. Yeah, bullshit. It's the game mechanic, Sean. You gotta survive. Are you fighting him hand to hand? I am. Good man. Punching the shit out remember, of him. <laughs> just remember, uh, if you want to power hit him, right click for the power hit. Uh, okay. He stunned me a little bit. Why just is remember, my... you have a bandage. You have my a bandage. Heart. My he heart. doesn't. Can I set him on fire with the torch? <laughs> Sure can. <laughs> yeah, you can set him on fire. Does he take damage over time? Nope. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, they will take dot damage. Shit. You got this. You're a professional. He's gonna kill me! <laughs> Five minutes in and I'm dead, Frank. He's eating my foot. <laughs> <laughs> Hit that subscribe button, everybody. Do it. Hit the subscribe button. <laughs> you can't get better comedy than this. You really can't. <laughs> it's alright, man. It's alright. You take a hit and keep on going. Are you, are you uh, coming? Me? I'm just gathering up some, uh, like I said, uh, in this place, is the only place to get the aloe vera. This fucking guy. So. You got this, man. Oh, finally. I don't have any more bandages. You got him? I'm bleeding, Frank. I'm bleeding out. I'm going to die again. I'm bleeding out. No, you're not. No, bleeding you're not. out. You're not gonna die. It's getting dark. I can't. <laughs> oh, it stopped. Okay. <laughs> Freaking house, man. Come on. Anybody else? That's what I said. Anybody upstairs? I hate the fact that the zombies can jump now. Yeah. Boom! Took you to the bank. Oh. Freaking floor is falling oh. out under me. <laughs> I'm fighting one of, the, one of the fat zombies right now. I just killed her. All right, let's put this bedroll down. Put my bandage on. See, I taught her a lesson. She don't know. This is my house. There. Ooh, what's in the washing machine? Nothing. Ooh, laundry basket. Anything here in the house? A flannel, a flannel shirt. I like Scrap. flannel. Yeah, well, I already scrapped it. Ooh, a toilet bowl. Dookie! You know, like I said on many of our other videos, uh, I am not a professional gamer. If you're watching this because you're looking for tips and tricks, you're in the wrong place. <laughs> not I, with me, you're not. You, you can hang out with me. I'm a professional at this. Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah. I'm pretty good at it. At least I think so. I've been told I'm pretty good at it. All right. I can make eight hours, John. Oh, boy. That's, I got the bone out, baby. Ready to go. 
Okay. I found a whole bunch of I found a whole bunch of feathers, but I don't have enough stone. I need to find some more stone. Yeah, I need small stone too. I need to get these quests, these beginning quests out of the way. I found some yucca. Yucca. We're gonna be drink. We're gonna be drinking some yucca, baby. Oh, I got some aspirin. Oh, thank God. Uh, the painkillers are good to heal you up, but they make you thirsty. Remember, why, why watch out for that because you do get dehydrated. Punching meat. There's a rock. Hey, stone axe. Uh, I know, I right? can finally make a stone axe. Oh, wood frame. Great. Oh. Okay. I'll place that right there. Rough. And I upgraded it. See, Pants. I'm fucking amazing. Okay. I'm so amazing, John. Dude, I'm finding so many eggs. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is great. You know what? If the desert didn't suck so much with the freaking heat, there's a lot of supplies out here. It's good for for a supply run. Yeah. But overall, it's like, man, I'm good. I don't ever. I don't. Ever I hate the desert. Here. I hate the desert too. It's my least favorite one. It's my least favorite biome. But you know, me what? and Mike it's, were playing one time in the snow. I remember we had a bunch of uh, snow guys after us. Yeah, those lumberjacks are hard to kill. Yeah. Those guys take a beating. Over here, pressing the wrong buttons. I need stone, John. I need stone. It's a fly in the studio. <laughs> I thought you killed that fly. Yeah, yeah. You didn't kill that fly yet? I did. They keep coming in. Unreal, John. Dude, your health is terrible. Uh, I don't want to talk about it. That didn't sound good. No, it did not sound good. What the hell did you break? Oh, yummy. I got food. Yummy. Gather wood. Chop some trees. Hey, dude. I'm thirsty and I need first aid. I'm not doing so well, Frank. You're all right. I started the game off a little rough. <laughs> it's okay. It's all right. We all we all have those days, John. <laughs> Let's see how much aloe vera I have. I have. Why do you have thirty-eight? I have thirty-eight aloe vera. I need two more. That makes forty. That makes ten things of aloe vera cream. Just think, bro. You need four to make the aloe vera cream, mm -hmm. which is for the first aid. Like bandages and stuff. Yeah. So I could heal you with just the cream. It won't heal as much. Oh, good. <laughs> so that's why I'm collecting all this before I come meet you. I'm going to spend like the day here and then I'll run over there the next day. All right. I'll just be over here chopping trees and collecting materials and drinking my coffee. You found coffee already? No, in real life, I'm drinking coffee. <laughs> oh, a little cafe, huh? Yeah. So yeah, we're on day fire. one. And uh, like I said, you know, we're going to be uh, doing 40 minute episodes until we reach day seven. 40 minutes, huh? 40 minutes. Oh, that's good. there is a lot of there is a lot of downtime. Well, especially during the night times, but Oh yeah, during the day you're searching, you're looting. Yeah. John. What? I see a rabbit. <laughs> I think I can get him. I think I can get him. I kinda like this old tree in front of the house. Looks nice. 
It's aesthetic. You know, John, you like that tree, you keep that tree, all right, buddy? I don't think that was a fly. I think it was a mosquito. It's in the studio. Oh, no. Oh, no. Kill him. Kill him dead. Kill him two times. Just landed on my hand. I'm pretty sure he got me. Son of a bitch. <laughs> oh, shit. It, was, it wasn't a rabbit. It was a chicken. Chicken. A chicken. Come here. I'm going to Kentucky fry your ass. <laughs> Where's John? John is that way. I gotta go find him. I found the trader. I finished that, uh... I finished the the initial quest. Now I gotta go see the, see, see the trader. Yeah. How much aloe vera I have? I gotta keep track. Put that in my tool belt. Right. Tons of bird nests, buddy. I'm gonna bring so many eggs. Let me know if you find a, a cooking pot. We need a cooking pot, then we can cook these eggs. I didn't see a cooking pot in the house. I know, they're so hard to find sometimes. See, you need the cooking pot to like boil the eggs or do some other stuff. Yeah. Make water, make water, definitely need it to make the water. Mm -hmm. And you know, need that agua, man. I'm overburdened, Frank. Yeah, that's a pain in the ass in the, in the, in the beginning. You know, I told you, once you, you got to build up your, your your strength and get the pack mule, get the pack mule feet. Yeah. That's like, that's like the first thing you want to get. Helps you out so you're not struggling to carry shit. How much yucca did I have? Where's my yucca? <laughs> yucca. Dude, the yucca fruit, man. Got to make the yucca juice. I know how to make yucca juice. I need, just need... The yucca and any water. That's it. And yucca juice is good. It, it it cools you down. You get more stamina back. Told you the desert sucks to to live in. Mm -hmm. But for but for materials wise, great. Because you get oil. Oil is only in 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 the desert. Very rarely will you find it any, anywhere else. Right. You need the oil to make gasoline. And there's the yucca, which is a great source of food and drink. And the freaking al and the aloe vera is only only. In See, so you might actually learn something tonight from Frank. I <laughs> lied. See, well, <clears throat> were you talking shit when I wasn't listening? No, not at all. <laughs> the lies. Not the me. Seat. Not me. I'm gathering all this first aid for you to heal your ass. I'm gonna rub the I wanna rub, rub rub the cream right right in your head. Oh thanks. <laughs> yeah. Appreciate it. Hey, you know what? In, in, a, in a zombie apocalypse, buddy, anything for you. You know what? Figures. I shouldn't have upgraded these. What? The windows. Why'd you why'd you upgrade them? I should have just broke them down and just put wood blocks. My bad. Yeah, the, blo the blocks sometimes aren't like the best things. Because at least... At least with the windows, you can see out of them. Yeah, but they're all paneled up now. So after you upgrade them. This guy. Drink some water. You guys thirsty. Yeah. My health, like what the hell? It needs to go back up. Uh, you need a bandage. I or don't have the... any. Yeah, that's the only way it's going to go ba back up. In this game now, the way they built it, the way they rebuilt it is you, um, like whatever you eat, whatever you eat raises your max health. As you gain levels, your your max health go, go goes up. Then you have to eat a certain food that raises that raises your health bar yeah. and once you take a certain amount of damage that you go into your gray health bar your health will be down until you use a first aid item to heal to bring it back up okay so no matter how much good food you eat 
it won't heal past that that number until you actually use something in first aid to make it better. Yeah. So they they made it a lot better. I mean, I love the inclusion of the zombie truck cuz oh my god, dude. When you build that, the both of us can ride in it. It's a two-person vehicle mm -hmm. with storage. So we could like go to a spot that we want to loot, park the car, and just jump out and just loot the shit out of the place, put it all in the truck, loot some loot some more, put it in, in our backpacks, and then and then run and then go back home. It's great. I, I think I'm really being attacked by a mosquito. Uh, it's, you are being strategically attacked. Yeah, like I, he got me twice in the hand, I think, and then now once on the back of my arm. Bastard. He's a piece of shit. <laughs> He's a piece of shit. Scrap you, take you. What's the ski goggles? I'm going to wear those. I'm going to take the flashlight. Throw that away. Actually, not give me that. I'll take that. I didn't mean to throw you. Ah! Oh. Fell through the floor. Damn it! <laughs> Gotta watch that floor, bro. Falling apart. This guy. This guy makes home in a starter house. Yeah, man. You never make home in a starter house. Why not? Cause they suck. Ooh, I found an iron pickaxe, dude. This one's actually pretty good. That one looked a little too broken to be fixed. So I'm just going to break it and put a new one. I know, but you want to try and find find a town. You want to usually make a house inside of a town so you're close to materials. You can loot the whole freaking town. Yo, I got so much stuff to sell. All right, guys. Well, we're twenty minutes through, and uh, let's um, let's take a few mi like a minute break and uh, take a look at a pod deck commercial. What do you guys think? Let's do it. Pod decks are unique interview questions and episode starting prompts in the palm of your hand. So whether you're a new podcaster or an existing broadcaster looking to take your interviews and podcast episodes to the next level, you're gonna want to check out Pod Decks. We love Poddex so much, we dedicated a whole segment to it in every episode. We definitely think every podcaster should have at least five decks on hand at all times. So go get the Poddex library. They have great conversation starters and making interviewing your guests a breeze. Visit poddex.com and use the code BASEMENT10 at checkout for 10% off and get your Poddex today. All right, and we're back. See? See how easy that is, Frank? <laughs> I'm I'm not complaining. I actually enjoyed it. Yeah. I thought I thought you were very professional. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. Alright. I don't even know. Is this a window or is this actually wood? No. Ain't nothing no more. <laughs> Oh, okay. And I just got attacked by a by a stripper zombie inside the trader. Because I forgot that the zombies can come in here. I didn't think the zombies she could go in the in the trader. They they used to never be able to, but now I gotta eat this. She infected me, John. Uh oh. That's it. Bitch gave me the clap. <laughs> You're gonna die. <laughs> no, I'm not. You wanna know why? Because old, an old Daisy uh, trick, the honey, the honey uh, takes away um, the the infection, but only up to a certain percent. Mm -hmm. So since she just infected me, and it wasn't that 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 much, uh -huh. I was able to drink the honey and take away the uh, the infection. Okay, so now I have to locate a traitor. Yep. There he is. Wait. 
My inventory is full. <laughs> it happens to the best of us, John. I always do that. Yes, you do. Put everything under the sink. Well, I sold everything. I hear footsteps. Quiet for a second. Quiet. Yeah, I hear footsteps. I got a I got a cooking pot, Frank. Beautiful. Yes. Yes. So I found the forge, John. Oh, yeah. It's broken. It's broken. I can't like use it. But inside the forge was a was a schematic mm -hmm. to to learn how to make forges. Okay. Hey. Which we we'll see, and you know me. You know that's the thing I love to do. I love to craft all the the smelting and stuff. I got a cornbread recipe. <laughs> I do love me some cornbread. <laughs> All right, I'm headed Cold down Bird. to the trader. This mosquito. You better hurry up. Good. Why? Oh, it's gonna be dark. Uh, Is well, that him? It changes. Uh, 22. At 22, it changes. Oh, that's a bridge. All right, I'll I'll do the. I'll do the trader tomorrow then. No, no, yet time. No, at 22 it becomes night. Okay, so that's what. Five minutes? Six minutes? You got time. Right. You got time, Charlie. You got this. Mm, beef ration. Yum. <laughs> beef. That's what's for dinner. Drink some water. Gotta keep my guy going, bro. <clears throat> if you like what you're Dookie. seeing, hit that subscribe button. Ring the bell. You don't want to miss anything coming out of the basement. So, John, I found the I, I found the cooking pot. I I told you I just told you I had one. Yeah, I know you did. I heard you. I was like, I'm just I'm, I was like, no, I found one too. Oh. Oh, well, now we have two. We can make double. <laughs> yeah, this mosquito got me good. <laughs> yeah, he did. He he fucked you up. He made you his bitch tonight. <sighs> Oh, that's right. I forgot. I'm I'm in here. I can't do that. Cheat. All right. I'm just looting the trader's uh, spot. Is that a coyote? There's shit. Coyote. Hey, that's a nice house. That's a church. It was a cemetery. Oh no! Don't don't do that. Why not? Uh-uh. I've been to the churches before. They just be busting out of coffins. Uh-uh. <laughs> uh. Fuck that. Goldenrod. Chrysanthemums. Oh. Yeah, we definitely need, need the goldenrod. The goldenrod uh, cures the diarrhea. Yeah. hate that diarrhea. It, it does. It does put a downer on my day. I got a zombie on my ass. That's, well, it's, it's your fault for having a nice ass. <laughs> so this town is pretty like the main city is pretty far away. The main city is hard to get to. I'm not sure where it is. Uh, I see it right now. Uh, I'm looking at it. Oh, you found it? Yeah, it's right by Already? the trader. Sure? It's right by the trader. The trader's like on the outskirts of the city. That's good. What else do I have to sell? I have to sell that. I need that. My sewing kit. I need to keep my sewing kit. Got my dookie water. <laughs> hey man, listen. You need the the murky water mm -hmm. to what'd you call? Um that is to make glue with bones. Lost, um. So yeah, you need that murky water. Alright. I mean you you could also boil it to make the drinking water, which is what you use to make all the different teas, but Yeah. You actually you actually need the murky water when 
glue using bones, yeah, you need the murky water. It won't use the regular water, the clean water. I don't think I'm going to buy it's anything. Just, I don't think I have money. Nah, don't, <laughs> don't buy none. Just just sell some stuff. Sell whatever you don't need. I, didn't br I barely brought anything with me. I'm going home. Oh, uh, this shit. Trader's not going to like you. He oh. hates when people come in and browse. <laughs> I'm going he home. <laughs> he curses me out all the time. I think... I think uh, this town looks pretty nice. We might move a little closer. But I'll, I'll do it tomorrow because by the time I get back to the house, get my bed. You know what I mean? I know what you mean. I feel you, dog. I'm out here. I'm not hearing the shit right now. You're still in the desert? I'm making my way. Well, I'm walking fast and I'm homebound, dude. <laughs> oh, God. Do, 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 do. <laughs> do, 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 do. I'm going to chop this tree. I'm going to chop that yucca. Yucca, yucca. Give me that shit. What is that? Give me that shit. Another bird's nest. Let's see if I get some eggs and got some eggs. <laughs> oh, what is that? Meteor? Level up. Look at you. Leveling up like a true professional. That's right. That's right. All right, let's What's head up? home. Leave the torch on for me, John. <laughs> I'm coming home. I'll leave the light on the porch on. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> See, I was in your head. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, I heard that. Oh, my God. I was running right towards him. Oh man, I wish I had space in my inventory right now. I just found a campsite, but there's a ton of zombies over there, so I'm just gonna say no. <laughs> because I am unarmed. That's a good idea. Walk around with with my bow. There you go. Hey John, if you got some wood, make us a chest. If I okay. can drop some of this stuff off. I'm trying to fix there. the floor first so I don't fall through the damn thing. Oh well, that's don't do too many upgrades in there because we might move. Yeah. No, we're definitely gonna move ne next uh, next episode. We're gonna move. Oh. All right, guys. I'm home. The sun looks like it's going down, and it's like a half hour into the episode, so we're going to end it here. All right, guys. Um, if you liked what you've seen tonight, uh, Frank and I are playing 7 Days to Die. Hit that subscribe button and then ring that bell because uh, we're going to be putting out a whole bunch of videos with a series like this. And, um, you know, it's just it's a lot of fun, you know. And Frank and I are going to be coming out with a bunch of games. Uh, Seven Days to Die, World of Warcraft, maybe League of Legends, um, just a bunch of different Let's Play series. So thanks for joining us today. Head on over to our website, thebasementsurge.com to download our uh, podcast and watch our videos and, you know, hang out and send us a note, read our blog, go to the website, thebasementsurge.com. Thanks, everybody, for joining us. We'll see you next episode. See you soon. Bye.